Bro, wake up. Hmm? Wake up. What time is it? It's 12. 12? Why, why are you waking me up then? Where's Mike? Dude, I just woke up. Alright, what do you know about this? A receipt for... No, the Sunday. other side. Went out. Ask Rob, Mike. So? So, so how am I supposed to know? Because the note said so. Chris, it's just a note. Don't be so gullible, man. Like, if Puff the Magic Dragon wrote this note, would you go all the way to the land called Hanali and ask him? Just forget it. I'll call him. Why didn't you just do that in the first place? I did it in answer. Hello. What are you do What are you doing with this phone? <laughs> oh yeah, um, my phone died, so I just took his. Dude, what the hell? Dude, calm down. What do you want Mike for anyway? Because he took my car. I don't know where, he's, where he went. I don't know when he's coming back. And I have a doctor's appointment in an hour. I'm going to kill him. Oh, well, that sucks. Let me know how that works out. Oh, I went back to the old apartment to pick up some stuff, and uh, then I'm going to the mall, and and you know I got a couple T-shirts at Hollister. I went to J.C. Penney's, Sears, Fortune Offs. Basically, I, if there was a store I didn't go to in the mall, I would have been surprised. And after the mall, I went across the street to Best Buy. I was looking at DVDs, and I kind of noticed that a lot of their DVDs were out of order. So I was talking to the guy about it. Before you knew it, I pretty much alphabetized the whole section, which, you know, that, that took a while. And after that, I was in the mood to watch a movie, so I went to Blockbuster, and I uh, was talking to the guy there, and I was like, what's a, what's a really good movie I could watch? And I you was know, talking about Lord of the Rings, and before you knew it, I rented all three. And uh, I watched them on my portable DVD player in your car. I just plugged it into the, uh, the outlet. And, and you took my car five hours ago. I must have made really good time then, huh? I have a doctor's appointment at 1. It's like 3 o'clock now. I know it's 3 o'clock now. Oh, well, sorry, man. You should have said something. How? You don't have your cell phone on you. What do you mean I don't have my cell phone on me? Of course I have my cell phone on me. It's right here. Or I thought I brought it. I definitely had my cell phone on me before. I remember plugging it into the outlet in the car, too. So that's... What are you doing? My face was not in your crotch. I was looking for my cell phone. Your face was in my crotch. Ah, if anything, my ear was in your crotch. All right. All right. Does it matter? Listen, this is going to work. We need to lay down some ground rules. All right? Okay. Let's get, let's get a little off the walls here. First, cell phone's on you at all times. Rob, make sure yours is charged. Well, I don't have my charger. I, pick, I picked it up from the apartment. All right. All right. That's good. Two, Mike, no wandering off just without letting anyone know, all right? Especially with my car. Open communication's key here, okay? This is going to work. I, I don't mind having you guys here. You're in a tight spot. I'm letting you use my basement. You're definitely more than welcome. But you're going to have to start chipping in around here. Okay? All right. All right, good. So I had to cancel my doctor's appointment, but I had a good talk with Mike and Rob. I think we'll be all right. Yeah, so I pretty much took his car, but I did ask him. I said to him, hey, Chris, I'm taking your car. 
And he clearly said, I don't want to go to school. So, who is the villain now? That's what I'm saying. You know who the villain is? It is clearly Rob. Because he took my cell phone. So my phone died yesterday, and that's why I took my phone, and, you know, I used it, and I guess I forgot to return it. You know, no big deal. I don't know why Mike and Chris were making such a big deal out of it. Who cares if I had his phone? You, you, you know, the real issue here is that Mike's head was within inches from my crotch. Come on. Ridiculous.